Hey everybody, what's going on? Thanks for tuning in to another video of One Tool A Week, guys. If you're new to the channel, we take a look at tools every week. We take a look at one tool. And also, if you love tools, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. So, next up, guys, I'm going to ask you a question. And let me know what y'all think. Everybody that's out in the field, what kind of recommendations do you have as far as work boots with laces and also western style boots or western style work boots and two things they have to have it's gonna be either steel toe or composite toe and also I want them to be waterproof so those are gonna be the two requirements guys it doesn't matter steel or composite toes but they must be work safe attire so with that being said let's jump in to the tool so this week in building our tool bag we're gonna go ahead and be adding a retaining ring pliers guys so if you don't know what retaining rings are they're gonna go inside some shower valves you're gonna find them you're gonna find them in valves also mixing valves uh, VAV boxes uh, backflows different type maybe some shafts it's gonna apply towards mechanics plumbing HVAC all kinds of fields in the mechanic field as far as fixing stuff so we're gonna be adding the channel locks 927 8 inch retaining ring pliers guys take a look at these babies right here they are gonna be pretty sweet so let's go ahead and open them up and just got them in let's go ahead and slide these out so. Alright, so if you're not familiar with retaining rings, they're going to be these babies right there. If you could take a look at them, there's one and two. Now you're going to have internal and external retaining rings. Now, of course, these babies are going to do internal rings from 3 8 to 2 inch or 9.5 millimeters to 50.8 millimeters. And external retaining rings, it's going to go from quarter to 2 inch or 6.4 millimeters to 50 0.8 millimeters take a look at them they're gonna be pretty sweet channel lock mate did a great great tool right here now it's also gonna include five pairs of color-coded interchangeable tips which are located right here in this little bag and also you have a pair right here already connected so the first pair it's gonna be let's go ahead and open this little ziplock bag or this little baggie right here with the tips and spread them out. Alright. So first of all, you are going to get two of the .039 blacks straight right here. If you could take a close look, they're going to be close. But .039 for the retaining rings. And you're, that's a pair right there. Two of them. And you're also going to get .039 black 90s. Uh, of course color coded guys uh, let me zoom a little bit back that way you can take a look at them uh, a little better there we go so two of them a 90 and straight and then you're gonna get two silver uh, let me grab them two silver 0 0.047 regular right there straight and then you're gonna also get two point zero four seven silver 90s as you could tell all right let's go ahead and put these on the side and then last but not least you're gonna get 2.074 coppers which are on there right now it's also gonna come with a little allen key guys the allen key is set right here all you're gonna do is just twist off uh, let me go ahead and twist it slide one of these babies out there you go and you're going to be able to swap them out. Like, get it to come in. Just like this one out. Right. Sorry, guys, they were tough with gloves. You're also going to have some extra two screws on there. And you're going to be able to slide these babies out if I could get it off. There we go. Slide that baby out. And let me get the second one off, which is being a little tough. I guess brand new in the package. Let's pull out these little tongue and groove pliers. Slide it out. There you go. 
of course the small little mini channel locks right here so this is gonna be the sets that they come with the five pairs of tips right here they're gonna come in handy believe me if you do mechanical work anything like that you know what a retaining rings are this is gonna be a great set just because you don't have to carry each individual plier if you know what I'm talking about you will appreciate the channel locks 9278 927 8 inch retaining ring pliers also it's gonna come with change from internal to external rings with a simple switch tap so the neat thing about these babies it's gonna be a little switch right here if you can look at it and it's gonna say uh, let me scoot a little forward if you could read it right here it says internal so this is going to work for internal rings which is going to spread it open that way you can slide it out and all you have to do is just switch it over right over here and it's going to read external EXT and then once you hear the click it switches so now every time you push it it's going to open it that way it's meant for external rings and you could pull them out and you can open it up and slide it out which is really neat thing guys it's really going to come in handy and it's also going to be have a heavy duty return spring right here that way you're able to just push it in and out it's going to work great more comfort for you and of course it's going to come with the channel lock blue handle right here so channel locks blue blue accent or patented blue color right here that way you know that they're channel locks and also they're going to be made in the USA for all you people that are USA only products America gotta love it now on Amazon you're gonna be able to find it for twenty three dollars and forty eight cents at Home Depot you're gonna be able to find it for twenty nine dollars and ninety seven cents now if you're looking for a tip replacements on all five you're looking at six dollars and twenty five cents for both of them on Amazon I'm sorry at Amazon and Home Depot guys so like I said go ahead and get, leave y'all's feedback below at far as what type of work boots I should take a look at next and I'll go from there and that's probably gonna be future video that I'll be making any questions or comments make sure you leave it below that way I could answer it or get back to you as soon as I can as always thanks for watching one tool a week guys